Welcome back to another hands-on closer look with Esper Lux. Today, we're lucky to have with us a rare piece of cutting-edge contemporary watchmaking, the Angelus U20 Ultra Skeleton Tourbillon. Dating back nearly 125 years, Angelus was one of the most influential horological manufacturers of the last century, with creations like the Chronodato and Chronodato Lux, among other calibers commissioned for well-known brands. Connoisseurs of high-end watchmaking have universally hailed Angelus' as pioneering in-house development and timepieces during the 1940s, 50s, and 60s. After several dormant decades following the quartz crisis, the revamped Angelus under its new parent company, manufacturer Le Jouperet, unveiled its first collection of the 21st century, the Urban Collection in 2016, upholding the brand's reputation for innovation. Like an Angelus timepiece, the Angelus manufacturer blends the very best of classic haute horlogerie with ultra-modern watchmaking production methods. The manufacturer embraces horological tradition by working classic materials such as precious metals, steel, and brass, as well as the challenges and possibilities presented by modern materials, like marrying steel, copper alloys, aluminum, titanium, and carbon fiber. Modern and innovative in its approach to watchmaking, Angelus creates timepieces that punch well above their price tag. And that's especially true for the Angelus U20 Ultra Skeleton Tourbillon. On its surface, the U20's movement architecture, loot bridges, and flying tourbillon all immediately catch the eye. Taking a step closer though, the real marvel of this timepiece is what's unseen. The attractive levitating effect of the movement is produced by a sapphire mainplate. This fully transparent mainplate is what allows this timepiece's owner to gain visibility of the movement, tourbillon, and all its mechanics from every angle. It's also an extremely laborious process as the bridge holes have to be polished out instead of drilling, which could lead to cracking the crystal. Combined, the skeletonization and sapphire mainplate strip the watch down to its bare aesthetic beauty. Under a loop, the U20 doesn't sacrifice any quality by focusing too much on the skeletonization of the timepiece. Components are chamfered, polished, and satin finished, both by hand and machine. Even the case is a finely crafted, innovative hybrid of titanium for the bezel and lugs and carbon fiber for the case and case back. Ultimately, what we love about the U20 is that it carries a modern form of watchmaking through the entirety of the timepiece. Movement and case, architecture, and materials. It's everything we love about 21st century watchmaking. The technical details. The Angelus U20 Ultra Skeleton Tourbillon is powered by Caliber A250. It features a one minute flying tourbillon with a variable inertia balance wheel set into blued skeletonized titanium bridges on a crystal sapphire mainplate. It beats at a frequency of 21,600 vibrations per hour and holds a power reserve of 90 hours. The U20 displays central hours and minutes with a one minute flying tourbillon at six o'clock. The case is made from NPT carbon fiber with grade five titanium lugs. It measures at 42 millimeters with a thickness of 10.3 millimeters. It is water resistant to 30 meters. Dial side glass is crystal sapphire. It is domed with anti-reflective coating on the inside surface. The case back is also crystal sapphire. The U20 is delivered on a stealth black alligator strap with titanium insert and titanium buckle. The Angelus U20 Ultra Skeleton Tourbillon is limited to 18 pieces worldwide. For more information on the Angelus U20, please visit esperlux.com. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for all new upcoming videos.